while I was doing the disassembly on the Craftsman Junior, I realized that the beam is not straight. Now, some of you guys might say, well, just put it in the vise and hit it with a hammer. That's how this got broken. Machinist vices aren't meant to be hit with hammers. They're for doing things like I'm doing here. You put something in there, you hold it while you use a hacksaw on it, you hold it while you file on it, you hold it while you use a wrench on it, but you don't hit a machinist vise. See this metal plate back here? This is a cast iron vise. It's heavy, it weighs about 60 pounds. But somebody drove onto this jaw and that caused this beam to rock up inside the casting and pop off the top of this cast iron. So I cut it off, filed it flat, and bolted on this piece of steel plate. Now the jaws line up straight and square again like they're supposed to. But if I went after this with a hammer, I'd bust it again. Some of you guys also might say, why are you putting so much work into what is essentially a $20 vise? Because that's what I paid for it. Sometimes it just bothers me to see things broken for no apparent reason other than somebody's ignorance. So, when I can, I like to fix things. Make them back to, if not where they were when they were new, at least usable. This is a cast steel vise. It's a good one. You're not going to buy one like this anymore without spending a lot of money on it. All the new ones are cast iron. Like this thing. Cast iron is a fine material to work with. It has plenty of strength huge amounts of compressive strength, not much under tension. So it's designed to not apply tension to the casting. You have to use it the way it was designed. 